Hello happy people, I'm back with another video and today I'm bringing you all another Bath and Body Works haul. This video is slightly late because this sale took place a couple of weeks ago but I have been busy for the last few weeks and um, I want to show you all what I purchased. I did take advantage of the, um, what was it, $2.95 for the body lotions at Bath and Body Works. Y'all, I have been doing so good with my no spin and or low buy and um, when I saw that deal, I could not let it pass me up. So let me show y'all what I got. I'm going to just hop in and pull whatever I find out of the bag. Um, so the first item that I purchased is Sea Island Cotton. So that's what the packaging looks like on here. Um, it says that it is crisp white cotton, clean linen, fresh orange blossom, blue freshia, and ocean musk. I got it because it's just a very clean, fresh scent. Yeah, it smells like nice, clean linen. So I was excited to have this. It kind of reminds me of, um, like, I guess, like almost clean laundry, I guess. Yeah, so I was just kind of happy to have it. Um, who doesn't like the smell of nice clean laundry? So <laughs> that's why I picked this one up. The next one that I have here is, this is one of my favorites, y'all. This is Winter Candy Apple, and I'm excited to have it in the new packaging. I do still have, um, I think, a couple of body washes and maybe like a half of a lotion left from previous sales or previous years, but I could not pass up having this in my collection again. So I absolutely love this scent, y'all. Mm. Winter Candy Apple is like probably one of my favorite Christmas scents. Unfortunately, I was so sad when I was at the store as I was checking out. I asked them, I was like, are y'all going to have coconut mint drop back? And they said, no. <laughs> my heart was broken. They have it in the hand soap, so I might or might not go pick that up. But I was happy that they at least had Winter Candy Apple. I thoroughly enjoy this scent. During the winter time, scent notes on it is uh, red apple, winter rose petals, and fresh cinnamon. This is just a lovely scent, y'all. My next scent that I have here is Twisted Peppermint. This is a nice classic. I actually have this in the shower gel. I don't believe I have the lotion, so just excited to have this in my collection. It is cool peppermint, sugared snow, and fresh balsam. I mean, and it just smells like a nice little candy cane that came off a Christmas tree. So, yeah, I got this. The next item that I have, now y'all, I racked up. I, I'm trying to shrink my collection and I racked up. But anywho, um, the next thing I have here is In the Stars. Now, this has become one of my uh, all-time favorite scents oh, from Bath & Body Works. It's such a, just a grown, mature scent, y'all. And another thing I like about it, too, is that it kind of reminds me of uh, Ariana Grande Cloud. I don't know if y'all have tried that perfume, that fragrance, but it smells so good. So to have just, you know, a cheaper alternative to that scent um, is really nice. But the scent notes on here is Starflower, Sandalwood Musk, Sugar Tangelo, White Arcwood, and Radiant Amber. So I have this. I actually think I got... Yeah, so I actually got two of these, y'all. So that's how much I love it. I'm just excited to have it in my collection. Now, some of these items, who knows? I might gift them for the holidays. Next scent I got, this is actually, I think, one of the new scents. It is Into the Night. So that's what the packaging looks like. The scent notes on this one is Raspberry Noir, Amber Crystals, Velvety Rose Petals, Creamy Patchouli, and Mocha Musk. Um, hmm, This is a really nice scent, too. To be completely honest with y'all, it, it reminds me of uh, Midnight Peony. So I'm actually going to probably pair this lotion and Midnight Peony together because to me it smells like it smells like the exact same scent to be honest. So maybe not as deep as Midnight Peony, but it's still essentially the same scent to me. So, But it smells really good. I do like it. So happy I picked that up. The next scent that I have here is White Citrus. Um, this was just kind of a random snag, but it is Lemon Zest, Sparkling Grapefruit, Ginger Flower, Freesia Petals, and Clean Woods. So, mm, yeah, it's just a nice, crisp, clean, refreshing scent. So, I really like that. I'm happy I picked that up. It kind of reminds me of something that I've used. Hmm, can't quite put my finger on it, though. But yeah, you can really smell the lemon in here, which is good. And I was really sad I couldn't find lemon cello in, in stores during the semi-annual sale. So this is kind of a nice little alternative. Although it's not the same, but at least I got my little lemon feel, you know. Next scent I picked up. Um, Tina Marie was hyping this scent up, so I had to pick it up for sure. It is Snowy Citrus Swirl. Okay. And then the scent notes on here is Chilled Tangerine, Whipped Marshmallow, Creamy Tonka Bean, and Fresh Vanilla. 
yeah this scent is really nice she's right it does smell just like a creamsicle like yeah, that smells really good. So, happy to have this uh, scent. I kind of like the fact that it's kind of a fruity scent. So, it's not something that's exclusive to just the winter time. I feel like you can kind of use this scent year-round. So, excited to have that. The next scent I have here is... Doo -doo -doo -doo, raspberry Sugar. This is also, I guess, part of the Land of the Sweets collection. Scent notes on this is Sugared Raspberries, Plum Blossom, Winter White Lily. And let's give it a, smith, a whiff here. Mm, this one smells good too. I mean, it smells like it low key smells like Winterberry Wonder to me. Um, but it smells good nonetheless. So happy to have that. And then I think this is it. Okay, yeah, this is my last item that I purchased. Okay, and I actually I think this is in my project use it up right now, which is Mary Cherry Cheer, y'all, and it is Orishino cherries, pomegranate cider, and sugared musk. Let's see. Yeah, this is just a nice fruity scent. Nice cherry, nice rich cherry fruity scent. So yeah, that is all the items that I purchased, y'all. I also got some gift wrap and some ribbon. I don't know if y'all know this or not, but you can uh, pick this up at the store. Um, they normally have it either out and about and or at the register. You can ask for it. Um, and likely what I'll do is I'll probably give some of these items. That has been one way that I have been shrinking my collection recently, I have just been um, getting a lot of these and packaging the items and giving them out as birthday gifts, um, different type of event gifts, housewarmings, whatever you want to call it. But I've been gifting the items um, and that has been a great way for me to kind of shrink my collection a little bit while also giving back to others and seeing them enjoy the products as well. So yeah y'all this is my haul um after this my goal is to not spend any more now now that i know that um coconut mint drop is not coming back this winter i probably will try to steer clear of the semi-annual sale and save my coins and put them elsewhere but i will continue to bring you all weekly um reviews of the items that are in my um collection um i'm really excited about just kind of like using up products um going through them and just enjoying some of my purchases so this will probably be the last big purchase that you see from me but don't quote me because y'all know what happened during the last semi annual sale but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this video have a great holiday season with your loved ones leave some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you have a wonderful awesome spectacular day Bye. <laughs> Bye. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful day. <laughs>